Hey guys, Tabby here and welcome back to my channel. Today I have my first ever box from Loot Crate, which is the official Wizarding World box of Harry Potter and the Fantastic Beasts. Ah, yes. So excited. Um, for those who aren't familiar with this box, like I said, it is a Harry Potter subscription box. Um, you get it every two months, which means it's bi-monthly. And yeah, I really just want to get right into it. So that is what we're going to be doing today. If you guys are interested, keep watching. And if you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and let's get into it. And this is the box. It has like a little sticker, which is the Chamber of Secrets. Ooh, okay, sneak peek. I see the shirt. I love the box. It's the Chamber of Secrets. Apparently these boxes reverse um, and so you have an image at the end so we'll see the box. But first I see the shirt. As usual I will show you guys first. Ooh. And it is, ah, oh, it is the Deathly Hallow symbol. That is so cool. Again, I'm not the biggest fan of skulls, but I actually love this shirt. We have the Resurrection Stone, the Elder One, and then this triangle is supposed to represent the Invisibility Cloak. Oh, I love this. And it is a Loot Crate exclusive. Okay, great start to the box. Next, I see a umbrella. Very cool, actually. Um, I think you can get these from Walmart, though. I think I've seen these before. Um, but I don't have one yet, so I actually love this. I got the, it looks like house symbols. So it's like the different houses and their crests. And a Harry Potter. I'm not going to open it. Um, I'm not super, like, super superstitious, but <laughs> again, let's not risk it. And next I see... Looks like a little mirror, and it's the mirror of Erised. So let's take a look. This is super cute. It is just a little mirror. Again, it's the mirror of Erised. Um, yeah, I really like this. Um, it doesn't have the wording, though. I would have thought it would have the wording um, if this is like an official licensed item. But yeah, I don't think this is a Loot Crate exclusive though because I'm pretty sure I have seen these elsewhere. But I actually really like this. Um, it'll be a really cool addition to my bookshelf. And next I see a little envelope. Let's take a look. It is art prints of the different Hogwarts founders. We have Godric Gryffindor and it even has his sword in there. Helga Hufflepuff and her cup, Rowena Ravenclaw and her diadem, and Salazar Slytherin and his locket. This is totally awesome. I absolutely love these. And what's really cool out of three of these um, and their artifacts, three of them are Horcruxes. Yeah, that is awesome. I am so going to have to get these framed and hung on my wall. And last in their box is their pin. Um, you get this in every box, and I'm super excited to see what we get this month. It is, it is the phoenix. It's fox. That is so pretty. Oh my gosh. I absolutely love this. Loot Crate is known for making awesome pins, and this is no exception. Wow. This might be my favorite pin. And that was it. That was the box. Um, let us take a quick look at their little, like, pamphlet thing that shows all the items. Um, and it says, Wizarding Worlds. That is so cool. And then it's like a little envelope on the back. <laughs> And this month's theme was Legends and Lore. Yes. We had the Deathly Hollow t-shirt, um, the Hogwarts House prints, Mirror of Erised Mirror, the Fox Pen, and the Hogwarts Umbrella. Oh, apparently you could have got two different umbrellas, either the Hogwarts House or the Marauder's Map. I'm actually glad I got the 
Hogwarts house ones, but the other one looks cool as well. So that was this month's pamphlet, but I wanted to show you guys the box real fast now that it's empty. Look at that. That is awesome. I want to keep this box just for the design. I love how Loot Crate really takes the time to like design their boxes. <sighs> So, yes, that was everything. You guys will have to let me know what you think. What was your favorite item, least favorite? Um, for me, definitely the fox pen was my favorite. Absolutely loved it. Um, I didn't really have a least favorite. Um, I was kind of sad that the Mirror of Erised didn't actually have like the writing on it, but it's still super cute. I can't wait to display it. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see y'all next time. Bye, guys.